Well, I guess uh, you could think about Edith Wharton's quote said, you can be the candle or the mirror. And I used to think blogs were candles, but now I also think they're mirrors. And by that, I mean, I used to think that they're all about people blabbing out to the world. And I, before I had a blog, I thought, oh, it's just blah, blah, blah. But I decided I couldn't criticize until I had my own blog. And then I realized it's also a mirror. Um, you can reflect back things of value that other people have created back out to the world, which might not be seen otherwise. So that kind of multiple of mirrors that can focus in on something and start bringing attention to it or awareness to it. And the other mirror it could be is that sometimes it's a mirror back to you. <laughs> um, sometimes I like what I see, sometimes I don't like what I see. But it's interesting that it can be both a candle and a mirror. And that's what I'm thinking about blogs these days.